Hi, I'm Elise. And I'm Camille. We are from Six Sisters Stuff, and today we are making our cowboy caviar. So I've got about six Roma tomatoes. You can use five or six, depending on their size, and we're just gonna cut these up. Okay, so then we're just gonna add everything to this big bowl to mix it all together. We've just got a can of black beans that are rinsed and drained. So this is just a can of sweet yellow corn that's been drained. Okay, so we're gonna do a green bell pepper. And same thing, just kind of dice it up and throw it all in. Next step, should I do the onion next? Yeah, we can do that. Dice this up. Okay, how do you cut jalapeno so you get the seeds out? I kind of just cut the edges down. It adds a, a little kick to it, I feel right. like, but not heat because you don't have the seeds, so it's okay. Yep. And it's, it really does add flavor. So even if you don't like it super hot, you can get the jalapenos that are, like that you can put on nachos that mm -hmm. aren't as hot. You can add those in here too. Just a couple tablespoons will be enough that you can taste totally. it, but not. It's not overpowering. Yep. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is an avocado. I just take my knife. Cut it one way and then turn it. Cut it the other way and then I just scoop it out with a spoon. Okay, so there's that. Okay. We and just gotta add cilantro. So it's about like a quarter cup, just chopped up roughly. You could throw in the whole leaves though, whatever you want. Okay, so here's the secret ingredient to this Italian dressing. So I have about three quarters cup. You can use more or less. And then I am gonna add a half teaspoon of garlic powder. And then it just needs to be mixed together. And it does taste better as time goes on. I feel like yeah. let it sit in your fridge for an hour or two, soak up the dressing, let the vegetables kind of do their thing. You can find this recipe on SixSistersStuff.com along with thousands of other recipes just like this that are super easy and super good.